Wow, <laughs> what another beautiful morning in Goa. So I got up quite early today, got straight up out of my tent, observed the hostel workers as they basically prepare for the day, giving the place a good clean up. And then I thought, right, I want to get to the beach first thing, because I've only been there in the evening. And in this episode, I just want to kind of explore right along the beach, because I've heard there's quite a nice maybe backwaters area or something like that where there's some tours possibly a bit of wildlife i've just heard about it anyway at a bar And in today's morning stroll of Palom Beach, we're going to try and get as far along here as possible and as possibly try and go around the corner and also get a little bit closer to that island. I just want to go and check it out. Good work guys, good work. Oh no. <laughs> A morning fall. <laughs> oh, this place is wonderful in the morning as you see people are even doing a bit of morning cricket the bats coming out nice and early people jogging people swimming i think i'm gonna have to get my swimming shorts out today as well because that's just too inviting so i think after this is done i might be back down here quite soon but yeah, just so relaxed, it's unbelievable. And the good thing is as well, it looks like it's shallow, really quite far out, because there's people like, you know, wading in water quite a way out there. So just absolutely perfect for swimming as well. We might have incurred our first little hiccup in the journey. <laughs> I wonder if we can get across here. Uh, we might be all right. Well, we might have got absolutely soaked in the process, but it was worth it. Okay, let's get around these rocks. What can possibly go wrong? And if there's a reason to come to South Goa and Palom Beach, then this is about it. You can't get much better than this. It gets to a point when you're exploring where sometimes you might have to turn back. I just want to keep going. What's around the next corner? Oh, this is, oh, this is an interesting little spot as we've got a bit higher up. I wonder if we can get back down now. <laughs> Uh, I'm trying to be a little bit careful of footing. <laughs> I'm not sure what the wildlife around this area is, but there's some rather venomous snakes in India. So I'm keeping, a, <laughs> keeping an eye out where I put my foot. I don't really want a bite from a king cobra. Here, thank you very much. And here we come up to the famous Shark Rock Point. I missed this <laughs> as I was walking the other side of it. Better not go much deeper, I'll tell you that. Fuck. It's a good job I'm coming back over here now. God, if I was over in an hour, I'd be stranded on that island. Well, that's my morning stroll done, I think. That's for sure. So now we're going to go back to the hostel, freshen up a little bit. We're going to go and grab some lunch. And then let's see what a Goan barbers are like, because I need a haircut. Hi. 
Oh, and did I need this? Ooh. It's actually really nice down here. I've not walked back this way, the roadway, back to the hostel. I always go the beach way. So yeah, really, really good. So if you want some spices, come to this place. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you. Spices and tea. This is your place. Look at this. Absolutely stunning. Amazing colours and smells. Brilliant. I'll be back. Thank you. And this place here is busy every single morning and lunchtime, so I'm going to go and check it out now. And I've had a few fish tarlies since I've been here, but I've not had a chicken one yet. So that's what I'm going to go for. Chicken tarly at 290 rupees, less than three quid. And here we have it. Look at this huge plate of food, tray of food, chicken tarly. Now I've been looking forward to one of these for a while. Well, this should fill me up for the day, shouldn't it? <laughs> Look how much. So here's like a green lentil kind of dish. Here we've got some vegetables. Here's the chicken curry. Here looks like some sort of sour cream. Maybe some like hot chili. We've got rice. We've got naan breads. We've got poppadoms with a little bit of salad underneath. Wow. <laughs> that was a nice meal. Absolutely lovely. So good. Wow, what a lovely lunch. A place you must visit if you're around this area. And now it's time for a haircut and we don't have to walk too far. <laughs> Barber salon. So let's see if they know what a skin fade is in here. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah. I usually, I, what I usually have in England, I have yeah, yeah. zero. Zero? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So there's zero, up there one, yeah, yeah. and up there two. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I'm sure, thank you, do what you want. <laughs> pleasant young man and what a lovely haircut looking sharp looking fresh three pounds he asked for I gave him a fiver and said keep the change so that brings the end to the video it started with a, a morning walk morning adventure then we grabbed some really nice lunch and then we went for a haircut 
absolutely brilliant what a great start to the day so it's back to the hostel again which will possibly be my next video i'm going to go into this hostel in more detail because it's a really really good one and yeah let's get editing these videos and maybe nip, nip to the beach in an hour or two all the best everyone i'll see you again very soon